Hi there, welcome to Southern TV. Today I'm joined with Joss, who is founder of Little Teapots. Hi Joss. Hello. Um, firstly, tell me about Little Teapots. Um, Little Teapots is a children's percussion class uh, business, so we run classes across South Essex at the moment. Um, okay. We're uh, running more and more classes as time goes on. Um, and it's a place for children to come, sing their favourite songs, play all sorts of instruments, every child has their own set, um, discover new and exciting percussion instruments and learn a few simple rhythms. Amazing, so it's such a unique concept and one that I've not stumbled across before. How did you think of it? Um, well, I wanted to do something more local. I was previously working in London and I wanted to be there really for the school run. That was a driving force behind it. Um, looking around at what there was, there was nothing that really ticked the percussion box exactly. Um, so I thought it would be a great opportunity for me to do something that I love and I'm passionate about for my work. Okay, and Little Teapots, where does that name stem from? In my mind, I'm thinking of the I'm a Little Teapot short Yeah, is well, that that's where it comes kind of from? where it really stems from, okay. is the children's song, um, linking it back to children's music. But really, it's a bit of a play on um, the fact that so many young children love to sit and bash pots and pans. Okay. Um, so it's linking those together. Okay, so percussion, why did you choose... That, that form of percussion thing. percussion is great for kids um, it's really good for development it's good for motor skills um, you're using your fingers your hands your arms and your feet okay. all at the same time it's excellent for development music is brilliant for kids anyway it lifts the mood um, on days when perhaps people aren't quite so happy um, it's a great way of expressing um, yourself <laughs> So every child has their own set of instruments as they come in the class. Okay. And um, we start off by playing along to some songs that they already know, just to yep. get used to the different sounds that all the different instruments make. And then as the class progresses, we get out new and exciting instruments. Um, every class is run on a different theme, so we have our Ted, and he goes on a different adventure. We've got one where we go into space, one where okay, today so our story is dinosaurs. Okay. Yeah, yeah, so, and we bring in those percussion instruments to, to help us um, feel like we're in space or we're on another planet. So how many kids are in each class? Uh, usually it's about 12, it depends on the venue. So I have some okay. venues that will fit more children in. So I can go up to about 16. Um, some of the smaller ones, it's more 9 and 10. And how long do they last? How long are the, the it's classes? It's a 45-minute session. OK, so you yeah. can keep the kids' attention for that long. That's yeah, it's lots of short, amazing. sharp activities. Okay. So we start off doing something that they know. Then we'll, we'll um, every week we put Ted to bed. We have to be very quiet, shaking our bells quietly. We do some start and stop music um, that really holds their attention. So there's lots of different types of activities all the way through. So obviously the children learn to play music at such a young age. What are the other benefits of being exposed to music? Um, I think uh, something that Teapots does is expose them to new types of music as well. So it starts with children's songs and it brings in more classical music as well, which okay. is, um, there's been various studies, uh, mainly in America through the universities, um, that show that children who are exposed to music at a young age and yeah. who learn instruments at a young age have um, higher reading ability later in life, they have better verbal memory. So it's really good for generally for children's development. Okay, so you've got a few centres set up now. Can you tell me where they are? Yes, at the moment we run at Kids Kingdom in Southend, okay. Monkey Business in Hockley, um, we run in Lee Community Centre in Rayleigh, um, and we're expanding okay, so month by month. Really. We've obviously, we've got some Southend TV viewers that will be dying to sign their kids up. How do they contact you? Um, you can email me at joss at littleteapots.co.uk okay. or go to the website, which is littleteapots.co.uk. Um, I've got a Facebook page as well with all the class times on it. Brilliant. Thank you so much, Josh. Thank you, everyone, for joining me today. Mm -hmm.